Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more Let's Play New Super Mario Bros. Last time, World 6 action. This time, conclusion of World 6 action. First though, 1-ups. Wait, why the hell am I doing this? I can't get, get anything from this. This is pointless. Oh well, maybe I can lose on the first try. Oh, nope. Okay, well I got two one-ups. As useless are the, as they are. And yeah, we're just going to move on to the next level because, yeah, why not? Is this the level I think it is? I think it is. Yes, it is, actually. This is the level I am thinking of. Because hooray, twisty thingy. Gotta love the twisty thingy. Gotta love how I'm calling it just twisty thingy. Instead of what it probably actually is. Also, break blocks for much fun. At the bottom, power up. Hey, Chain Chomp. You do not like my recording software, do you? Making it glitch up like you are. And we can do this again. I believe this is just for coins, though. That's it. Two coins! Okay, that was honestly not worth it at all in the slightest. Way to disappoint me, game. Way to disappoint me very much. Also, P-Switch. Okay, second star coin is over here with Mr. Chain Chomp. Let him calm down and then grab his treasure. Then, run the hell away from him. <laughs> and then fall all the way down the level. <laughs> yeah, that's a good move. Chain Chomps don't mind fire, apparently. Well, they might not, because they're, like, probably, what, made out of, like, some very, very, very high-density metal or something? I don't know. Something like that, anyway. No idea what I'm doing or where I'm going, but whatever I did, it's been done. Actually, you know what sucks? I probably shouldn't have came this far down. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm good. Basically, you want to break this set of blocks, then you want to get on the spinny thingy, then you want to... Well, not do that. Or that. Come on. Come on, Mario. Mario, stop that. Jump. Okay, you know what? Screw it. <laughs> I'm doing it this way. Why? Because stuff. I know, that's a very good reason. Stuff. And I didn't do it. Kind of hard to see what you're doing, though, when you can't even see the enemy above you. Okay, there we go. I think we got this now. Haha, take that game. You thought you could keep me down? Well, you thought wrong. Yeah, let's grab all the coins when the coins aren't going to do anything for me. <laughs> because I am apparently that anal about it. But anyway, we are done with this level, so let's go ahead and finish. Oh, we're not even done with this level yet. Oh god, I better hurry up then, because the timer is not going to be friendly. Especially because time counts down while I'm going through these pipes.
And there we go. Okay, so that was level 6-6. Six, six. That actually took a long time. But either way, we have access to the castle now, so that is where we're going to go next. And just saying for the record, I think this uh, castle has probably my favorite boss in the entire game. Just saying, my own opinion. Yeah, World 7 boss is pretty cool too. But, yeah, I kind of like this one. In a way, it's kind of a reference to uh, Super Mario Sunshine. A little bit. Okay. Guessing I'm going to want to use Mr. Koopa. Oh, wow, you actually have to use Koopa to get this coin. I was unaware there were some scenarios where you had to use Koopa. I know there definitely were in New Super Mario Bros. Wii, but in this game, like, I never remember having to do that before, but I guess for that you had to. Hmm, the things you learn. The things you learn even after you've already played this game <laughs> and should know everything about it. <clears throat> Let's jump up here. Okay, um... I want to do this, actually. I'm going to go back this way a little bit. Almost get killed by this stupid block. And we want to use this Koopa to make things easy for us. Or maybe we won't. Why? I have no freaking idea. Okay, now I can do it. No, I can't. Maybe I shouldn't even use the Koopa. Maybe the Koopa's not really... Shoot, I need to stop making stupid jumps. Okay, let's uh, wait for the platform to get to... its highest point now. There we go. This will take us to this coin, and then we have all the star coins now. Once again, that was an instance where I actually missed the star coin on my practice file. That's why I love doing doing practice files now, because I'm actually playing this game pretty well, considering... Okay, so now we just need to climb this tower. This tower of tragedy pushing blocks and then a red door how boring okay so here's the boss of world six it's not bowser jr it's actually a giant cannon not just any cannon though it's a monty mole cannon see the super mario sunshine resemblance now No! Damn it! <laughs> oh god, that's like the infamous thing where it's like, you throw a bomb up in the air to get rid of it, but then it comes back down and you catch it, and you're like, oh wait, why did I catch it? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and just do this again. There's not too much content here. In a way, it almost kind of reminded me of Futurama when, uh... Oh, uh, hold on, guys. 
Thank you, person who interrupted my recording. Anyway, let's uh, get back to the game. If I can actually press the right button. Uh, yeah, we were grabbing the star coin, and then we were kind of doing stuff. Okay, let's go through here. I should have actually included that phone call in the video. Kind of an inside joke that happened, but whatever. Okay, let's try this again, stupid Monty Mole Cannon. Um, oh shoot. I did it again. Dang it. Yes, you are. Oh, come on! I just jumped right into it. Uh, wow. Okay, this boss is actually giving me some problems, believe it or not. Okay, let's try this again. Ah. You know, you think Mario would be wise to know that... Oh, hey, he's probably going to charge into my back again. Oh well, Mario's not too smart, I guess. Aw, oh, dang it. Oh, come on! Really? Now I have to do this again? Okay, I'm gonna watch out for the bomb this time, though. No! I don't want your bombs, man. Your bombs do not help me in the slightest bit. I said your bombs do not help me in the slightest bit. There we go. Look at that bob bomb is right there like in his hand while he was dying. Okay, there we go. Finally, World 6 Castle has been completed. It took four extra minutes that I wanted to take that I didn't... Like I said, I didn't want to take, but whatever. Also, there was no ghost house in that level. I'm actually kind of disappointed, because I love the ghost houses. But yeah, here we've actually made it to World 8, and as you can see, World 8 is not very big. There aren't very many levels, but... Um, we're obviously not going to investigate that just yet. Instead, we're going to go back to World 7 and take care of things here. Starting with this level. World 7 is essentially the cloud world of the game. Oh god, there's a star coin in this level that's really, really annoying to get. Not looking forward to getting that one. As for this star coin, just ride the platform down here because, yeah, that's all you have to do. Oh, dang it! Why did I jump? I mean, I would have had to jump for the star coin, but I shouldn't have jumped so early. That kind of threw me off my balance, so to speak. For some reason, though, this reminds me of Cheese Bridge Area from Mario World. Minus the saws, obviously. Papa. Okay, there we go. Okay, you see that winged block? For one, keep it alive. 
you don't want to hit it too early. And now you want to stand on it and wait for it to get all the way over here to where this pipe is. Then go inside the pipe. Yeah. <laughs> That's kind of annoying, in all honesty, but hey, whatever, we got it. Hooray, we can actually get some of our one-ups back that I lost in the stupid Monty Mole fight. Yeah, part of me wants to go back, because I don't... That'd be kind of stupid, though. But I think I miss a star coin by not going back. I don't know. Almost freaking died right there. Great job, Slim. Great job. Eh, yeah, maybe I don't. Maybe I'm just not thinking right. fire chomps. Those things can be mighty tricky to deal with. Yeah, th yeah, that's kind of stupid. Like, you, you have to do this level twice because you missed the star coin otherwise. Thank you so much! And that'll take us to the ghost house, which, uh, yeah, I'll definitely do that level, but very quickly. Cut to star coin. Okay, kind of overkill, but whatever. <laughs> Basically, the star coin is on this lift right as you enter the pipe and get the midway point. Just take the top path, and you should get it no problem. See? That easy. Okay, here we are back at the map, and we got the star coin, and we're going to open the signpost, and then we're going to go to the ghost house, and after that, we're probably going to end the video, so... Let's do that ghost house. As usual, because this is a ghost house, there are two exits. Okay, so we have a room with a door and a few ghosts. That's really all we have. You know what? I don't think this room has enough doors. Oh, there we go. That'll do. Okay, so yeah, we have kind of a... Not really a maze, but we have kind of a... Maze of rooms, I guess? Something like that? I don't know. Whatever you want to define this level as. Knock yourself out. Uh, the first star coin and the second star coin are in the left and top door, respectively. If I remember correctly. That seems to be the case. For this room, you have to pound down on the yellow stuff. I don't know what else you'd call this stuff, but whatever. It doesn't have a very pleasant look. And I believe this room right here is the room we're looking for when it comes to the <clears throat> secret exit and normal exit. As you can see, we have these hands at the top and they're pointing to something. What are they pointing to? A secret block that has a switch inside. Now I believe you actually have to find this block in order to actually continue the level. Come on, don't get stuck. Wow, why am I having so much trouble with this? Oh, I know why. I'm a dork. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> now, in this room, we have a P-switch that will turn all of these coins into wooden blocks. 
And the wooden blocks will take us to the, like I said, the secret and the normal exit, respectively. Let's do the secret first. The shiny block right there will actually reveal a vine. And the vine will reveal the secret exit. That's simple. Could have got a one up there, but eh, don't need one. Literally. This will take us straight to the tower if we so choose, but I'm not going to choose. But yeah, basically, hurry up, get up here, get up here. Woo! That was close. But yeah, star coin there, and uh, wow, we're finishing the level, so hurry for that. So yeah, this has been Slim Kirby. This has been Let's Play New Super Mario Bros. I will see you guys next time when we continue through more of World 7. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time. Later, folks.